Yeah, like as an engineer, you kind of emotionally attach yourself to the song, and then you kind of just use your emotions to know if you tweak this and, you know, if, if you feel something in there, you kind of know if you did a right, uh, a right move on it or whatever. But yeah, I kind of look at mixing as kind of like taking like an old beat up car and then kind of restoring it back to, to new kind of, you know? You can use different mics and pair them up with different pre's and to get some new shit going on, you know? So, you know, it's really, um, it's, like, it's like a lot of trial and error when you're dealing with it and you just find the one that works best for you or with what budget you have or what, you know, what you got, you know? And it's really about your ear, you know? And what sounds good to you. Sometimes I like to burn some incense <laughs> clear out That's the it, energy. just the incense? Okay. You know, there's a wood called Palo Santo, uh, and it kind of <laughs> like clears the, the air out, you know, all the energy, because when people are like performing, they're like releasing a lot of energy out and it gets trapped in corners and shit. And, <laughs> you know, you gotta, you gotta like clear it all out for the next person to feel that, you know, energy, or else it just gets all like suffocating. Just stick with it as long as you can, you know, because the longer you stay with it, the better you get the more your competition figures out that it's not what the, what's for them, and then all that's left is you. So, you know, just stick with it.